Hey everyone, Jay Poole here from Buckeye Marine. Um, I'm excited to show you through this all new 2022 classic fish in the C4 configuration. Um, it's a pretty cold January, but we've recently restocked our showroom with all new Crest stuff. Um, we're really excited to be able to show. So if you have any questions, you wanna see any custom walkthroughs, um, please feel free to hit us up in the comments below or um, email us at sales at buckeyemarine.com and we can schedule a you know a private walkthrough. Um, we're really excited um, to be partnered with Crest. We've been with Crest for a couple of years now. Um, they are part of the Mastercraft family um, and they've done a really nice job of providing really cool high quality pontoon boats um, that have some really unique features. So we're going to climb aboard. We'll walk through this uh, C4 fish and you can sort of see what it's all about. So starting at the front here, the C4 configuration um, refers to the seating. So one of the nice things about this setup is you have two um, upfront fishing chairs. They are removable fishing chairs. So if you use this boat on an island or something like that, you can actually gain this space back and have um, lots of flat space for storage. Um, there is another layout that will give a sort of full regular, you know, what it, you would consider a traditional style bow with just fishing seats in the back. But the C4 has fishing seats up front as well as the back. Um, one of the things I really like about this boat is it gives you these two sort of pods on each side um, with little recessed trays so you can, you know, set your hooks and, and baits up front. There's also little storage spaces um, down underneath along with rod holders and cup holders. So you've got a really nice sort of space if you're, you know, if this is your corner and you're fishing out of it, you've got a little cubby there that you can put bait um, and you can put your you know, all stuff in. You can have a nice spot to set your rod down if you, um, if you need to go and check something out, out, else out in the boat. Um, like a lot of the fish models, this one's also equipped with you know, a quarter door. The idea behind that is you can mount yourself a uh, trolling motor. We don't have this one mounted with a trolling motor, but the nice thing about it is it is pre-wired, so we actually have a trolling motor plug right here. So um, the way we do it, we order them blank, and then you can pick your own trolling motor with your own thrust options, but the nice thing is, is the hard wiring is all in there, so all we have to do is mount a trolling motor and plug it in. This boat's also equipped with a change room. Um, Crest also has an option to put a bunch of different features in there. They've got one with cubbies and um, dog food trays and um, also a, a table here. Um, this one we've, we've opted for the change room, which is really nice. You can you know, use that space to put your bathing suit on or get into dry clothes after you've gone swimming. Um, it's a really nice option that a lot of people love to have. Um, as you sort of move into the center of the boat, you get into a more traditional seating layout. Um, one of the nice things about this is in the Crest models, you've got lots of storage under all of them. This one, um, and like all of our Crest, has a dedicated trash can. Um, we've got our small drink holders that you can kind of tuck in under either side and have drink holders con convenient to wherever you're sitting. You've got storage under all the seats here, as well as a, an access under the lounger here into the back side of the compartment there. Um, this boat is equipped with a live well, so you've got a nice big live well. It's central in the boat, so you can um, either keep bait in there or you can keep your, your fresh catch in there. And we really, I really love the way that Crest lay out their driver's helm. So you've got a nice, big, comfortable bolster. Everything is front and center. It's nice and clear. We have a Fusion Bluetooth stereo. All of the speakers are illuminated and they use them also as a courtesy light. So all the speakers throughout the boat have blue illumination. Um, we've got a standard cooled cup holder and all of our crests come standard with hydraulic steering, which is really nice. Um, regardless of what motor you, you opt to put on it, the steering is nice and light, really easy to maneuver. We have this one rigged with a 60 Yamaha. This one has a standard two-tune package. Um, so just a really nice affordable uh, affordable setup. Moving back into the back section, this is kind of our, our rear casting area. Um, they've got some really nice fishing features. So again, we've got our sort of small pod here where you've got your cup holders. Um, you've got a speaker there on the right here. This is where 
our trolling motor batteries are. There's a little bit of storage in here as well. You've got a nice sort of cutting board material. It's also got a little, little measurement there so you can see how big your catch is, along with some extra cup holders. And then we've also got some dedicated rod storage as well as some dedicated tackle. Um, so it comes with um, some Plano boxes. You, you can put your own, you can have a nice dedicated space. We've got another space for our main batteries in here as well as some storage. Um, so, so sort of throughout, there's lots of space for storage. Again, these are removable casting chairs. Um, if you, the nice thing about them is because they're sort of a standard style casting chair, if you wanted uh, a bicycle seat or something specific, um, it's easy to replace this chair and put a, something different on. But these are really nice um, convertible chairs. You can actually sit on top of them too if you want. Um, or you can have the, you know, sort of high back lounger for sitting and casting. Nice wide area to, to cast from. And they push the, the rails all the way out to the outside of the back of the boat. So um, you will have the motor on there, but you have a really nice area here. Throughout the boat, the one thing I, you know, we'd really notice with the crest line, there's lots of really small details um, where they've kind of put in a lot of quality. The doors all have latches that hold them open and closed, so they're not gonna rattle if they're in the open position. Um, lift, lift to lock doors. All of the rails are powder coated. All of the corners have sort of detailed crest emblazoned uh, caps on them. Treads as you come in and out of the boat have crests stamped in them. Nice stainless steel ladder with high handrails, really easy to use. It's a four step ladder as well. And then even the detail on the uh, motor well, normally where a lot of manufacturers would have stamped cut edges, someone's gone around and take the time to take a welder and roll over every single edge on the motor well. So all those edges are rolled over, they're not super sharp, and you're not gonna worry about cutting yourself if you've got little ones swimming in and around the engine. Nice bimini with lots of coverage. They bring it down in the corners here to get yourself a little bit more sun protection. Um, it's a nice tight bimini. It's got the, it's got the um, light mounted on top. It also has you know, a secondary bar here. So if you're gonna run it in the down position uh, or you're trailering it, it'll lock in the down position. They do a really nice job with their biminis. And uh, on this fishing model, it's sort of just the right amount of coverage. So it covers this sort of nice center lounge area, but you've got lots of space for your rods if you're casting on the front or the stern platform. So finishing off the boat, you know, we're really happy to work with Crest on these boats. Um, really high quality. We've done seagrass matting in the, in the bottoms of all of them, um, which gives you sort of a nice underfoot feel, but you don't get that sort of dirty look of carpet. Um, it's a really high quality look. They've done a really nice job with all the upholstery so that, you know, things are um, nice and simple, but really have a high quality feel to them nice vinyls. They do a really nice job of having the doors in the right spots. So we've got a, a dock side door on this side. We've got a rear quarter door on the back. Um, so we've got really nice, easy access in and out of the boat. And most fishing, a lot of fishing models have really low rails on the front. We still have a nice high rail. It's cut down a little bit at the front, uh, but still high enough that you're not gonna be nervous with small ones in the boat. So it's been a quick walkthrough of the Crest C4 fishing model. This is a 200. They also make it in a 22. Um, but if you want to have a look, you can give us a call at 705-738-5151. Visit us online, buckeyemarine.com, um, or you can hit us up on email, sales at buckeyemarine.com. We'd be happy to do a virtual walkthrough or in person in our all-season our all-season showroom. Thank you.